When it comes to planning of mega cities, the trophy goes to Beijing city in China. The second biggest city in People's Republic of China has many lessons to offer many city administrators in the world. Beijing, which is one of the biggest metropolis in the world, has a population of more than 20 million people crisscrossing this expansive land. But there is a striking difference with many other mega cities in the world. The levels of cleanliness and order on high roads. With a city like Beijing, traffic jams should be on top of worry list for any visitor visiting this city. But this is not the case. Beijing is China's political, cultural and educational center. It is home to the headquarters of most of China's largest state-owned companies. The city is served by a labyrinth of national highway, expressway, railway and high-speed rail networks. Her broadways, which links the city to its suburbs, are wide and well marked. Due to stiff penalties, traffic rules are obeyed to the letter. Now, the administrators of this city want to teach managers of the city of Nairobi a lesson or two on how to help Nairobi manage her chaotic public system and road network. Officials from the Beijing Transport Management Bureau will help to address the menace of housing in Nairobi, the city's transit transport system and the funding of the nine transport corridors to open up traffic in the city. Nairobi County Governor Evans Kidero, who was in China last week, announced that he has secured funding to the tune of 80 billion shillings to modernize transport and address housing problems in the city. Beijing city officials say, due to her importance as a transport hub in North China, the city is served by five ring roads, nine expressways, 11 national highways, nine conventional railways, and two high-speed railways. On the other hand, Nairobi is served by four national highways and a highly inefficient conventional railway system. The city is currently developing two ring roads to help in decongesting the greater Nairobi.